Educational YouTube channels are making anywhere between two to $60,000 a month on YouTube. And the best part is, in 2023, by leveraging artificial intelligence tools, you can start doing the exact same thing. So in today's video, we're gonna go through step-by-step -step on how to create a brand new YouTube channel and integrate educational forms of content using AI and not much upfront work. Welcome back to TQM or the Quintessential Millennial Channel, where we talk about all things millennials with an emphasis on finance. If you are new around here, it would mean the world to me if you would consider smashing the like button down below, subscribing to the channel, and also turning on that post notification so you can be the first to see the content as it comes. And I do hope that you find this information useful and not just for this video, but all the other ones that I've already created on the channel. So what you see here on the screen is one of the biggest educational channels on YouTube. And it's one that I personally have utilized and consumed throughout my high school and even college career. And that is Khan Academy. So with Khan Academy, they've amassed over 7.3 million subscribers with over 2 billion views since 2006. Honestly, just thinking about that number, 2 billion views, that's almost a fourth of the entire world. Another educational channel that I want to cover is Crash Course. They have 14.5 million subscribers and over 1.779 billion views also since 2006. So looking at Social Blade and looking at some of the analytics between these two channels for Khan Academy, they're saying they're making anywhere between two to $32,700 every single month. And then for Crash Course, it's anywhere between three to four, three, three point four thousand to fifty-five thousand dollars a month. These numbers are incredible, and I always say Social Blade can sometimes be a little bit more—I don't want to say the word naive, but underestimating when it comes to their reporting of different revenue values. I've looked at my own channel on Social Blade, for example, my main channel, and it was also undermining some of the things. So again. Take this for a grain of salt, but understand that if it says 55K on the upper end, it might be closer to 60 or even $70,000. So the question becomes, how do we make content similar to that of Khan Academies? We're not world scholars in informational, in the informational age, or we, we might not be individuals who know everything to do with chemistry or mathematics, but we don't need to be professionals anymore. We can utilize, as I mentioned earlier in the video, different types of artificial intelligence. And I'm gonna show you again, step-by-step step on what you should do and utilize to start creating your own content. So after you go about creating a brand new YouTube channel and making a Gmail and everything that's required to do so, then it's time to start utilizing these AI tools. So the first thing that you wanna look into is this platform called Synthesia. So Synthesia is a platform that creates videos from plain text in minutes. And the best part is, Oftentimes you probably hear on YouTube and other platforms on these automated videos. People keep mentioning them, especially on smaller social media platforms. And you can hear about them on TikTok. I made X amount of dollars on my automated channel. Well, automation doesn't just, just mean faceless anymore. Automated means utilizing AI to even have maybe a character that is represented visually on a video on every single episode you publish with information that you're giving and we're talking from an educational channel standpoint. So what I wanna do here is just show you guys one of the examples that they have. I'm gonna grab my headphones and let's listen together on this quick sample of Synthesia's AI video creation platform. Hey, I'm Anna and here's a quick Synthesia product demo. Start by selecting an AI avatar. Like me. Or me. Or me. And you can see, you can change the race of the individual. You can change the voice and the tone based off what it is that you're trying to deliver. Then type in text in over 65 languages. 65 languages. So then when you look at Khan Academy and you look at things like Crash Course, most of those are offered in only the English language. So what if you came in and disrupted the space and looked into it in Chinese, in Arabic, Korean? You decide and choose a narration style or local accent. You can change the accent. When you're ready, I'm add sorry. your text, shapes, <laughs> so and other design about this. elements. 
choose a font or upload your own. You can also upload other brand assets, such as your logo, which you will find here for any future videos. So not only can you create this AI or artificial intelligence, basically mimicking a human, you can also, in addition to that, add on things like video editing, on-screen texts, logos, animations directly with Synthesia. This isn't just any platform. If you could see some of the companies that are already using it, over 40,000 companies as of today are using Synthesia, including the one of the biggest publicly traded companies in the world, Amazon. As a pharmacist, I respect Novo Nordisk because they make a lot of different insulin products and anti-diabetics. So again, as a big pharma company, they're utilizing Synthesia. Accenture, big consulting company, BBC, British Broadcasting, one of the biggest news stations might have some people that aren't really people, but just AI giving you some of the news that you're hearing on a day-to-day -day basis. And that gives me a quick little caveat and something that I wanted to add is, especially right now, you guys have probably seen all the different AI bots and AI features that are coming out. So be careful what you're consuming. Because what if I was an AI making these videos? Always try to verify and find ways to do so before just 100% claiming something as true. Because now, when it comes to fake media or fake posts, there's probably just way too many. Teleperformance is always used, and Reuters. Really big platforms are using these AI tools. You go to Synthesia, but you need to find some text that you put in to have this AI create you a video. We'll use one of my best friends these days, ChatGPT. You go on their website from openai.com, click the try chat GPT thing. It's gonna have you log in with your email. And what I did for the sake of being a pharmacist, I decided, you know what? If I was to do an educational channel on YouTube today with an AI or artificial intelligence um, behind it, I would probably wanna talk about medications, medications and medication safety. So the first thing I wrote here to chat GPT, write me an educational YouTube video script that is engaging regarding the medication Tylenol. Starts with an introduction. Welcome to our video about Tylenol. Tylenol, also known as acetaminophen, is one of the most commonly used over-the-counter medications in the world. It goes in and talks about what Tylenol is, how Tylenol works, and I was pretty impressed. Perfect mechanism of action. So again, for any pharmacist or maybe pharmacy interns, technicians watching, you'd probably be impressed by this here. And then the safe to use Tylenol, what dosage to take, depending on, you know, what situation you might be in. It's pretty incredible how quick ChatGPT created the script within literally not even two minutes. So you take the script, take it over to Synthesia, paste your script into this program. And some of you might wonder how much is Synthesia? So there's two different pricing models that they have. There's a personal and a corporate side. And for all of us watching, most likely you're gonna be on the personal side, which is $30 a month. And we talked about how much money these educational channels can potentially make. So I'm talking now 55K a month, with Khan Academy 32K, are you gonna start off with those values? Absolutely not. But are you gonna at least get an ROI on the money you're spending because ChatGPT is free? Absolutely. So now we went on Synthesia, we pasted our entire script. The AI bot created a wonderful video that looks very appealing with the accent that we want, with the person that we want. Okay, it's about time to publish on YouTube, but I wasn't fully happy with all the editing that Synthesia did. I wanna add some of my own little things to it. There's one more tool you can utilize if you have no video editing experience, and maybe you don't wanna use something like Premiere Pro or Final Cut Pro. So you use Descript, an AI tool that will literally take the script that you created, you paste your video into it, and now you can start adding different animations, different on-screen texts, and things in addition to what was offered already on Synthesia. 2023 is, I kid you not, the year where AI disruption will begin to take over. And one thing I wanna mention, and I'll put it right here, right on top of me, and that is a tweet from OpenAI's CEO and the founder, Mr. Sam Altman. And he stated that artificial intelligence, and I'm just kind of paraphrasing here, but artificial intelligence is the biggest disruptor and something that will literally change economic empowerment in individuals worldwide. And those who utilize it, understand it in a deep learning standpoint, from a deep learning standpoint, will potentially become rich. I've showed you applications on the channel and there are so many more coming your way. So again, if you haven't already, 
consider subscribing if you like the content and let me know down below what are you going to do in terms of content creation or leveraging these AI tools to either grow your business or even just get started. Stop letting the days go by of just content consuming and instead start creating. Thank you so much for tuning in. That's all I have for you guys today. And until next time, everybody, as always, take care.